السلام عليكم ورحمة الله This is Hany Ismail from Planning Engineer website In this video I would like to answer one of your questions about how to update one schedule from the other I mean here if we have an updated schedule okay and we have some changes to our baseline let's say we created a recovery schedule or revised schedule or whatever and we didn't change the activity id can we update the new baseline from the updated one let's see we have here an updated schedule and we have here also this is our baseline so we have one version without any update and another version with the update let's see how to do it it is very simple first of all we will go to the updated version we go to file export then we will go to spreadsheet select activities and then we should create we should select the following columns in the update in the export Activity ID, activity status, WBS code, activity start, activity finish, activity percentage complete. This is very important. Not duration percentage complete, not cost percentage complete. It should be activity percentage complete. And we will go and export this one. Let's. Ex I will export it on my desktop. I make new folder here so I can find it easily. Update this line and I will just save it okay now if I go and try to import this one into my baseline it will cause for me problems if I'm trying to change the name of this one and update my baseline it will cause for me some problems because of the WBS and so on so what is the best scenario to do it the best scenario is to go to your baseline and then export the same file for the baseline spreadsheet activities and again I'm going to I made already one template for the update, but I would like you to know what is inside it because it is important. Activity ID, activity status, WBS code, actual start, actual finish, actual percentage complete, and this is very important. Not other percentage complete. It should be activity percentage complete. And then I will export this one also to my folder. That's it. Now, I have here the baseline. I'm going to open it this is what I have right now and I have here the updated one which has the data on it and that that's it is what I'm going to do now is I'm going to use the VLOOKUP here and try filling start filling all this data from the other sheet so I'm I will do VLOOKUP I will look for the activity ID where I will look here I will look in this sheet I will get the column number two and I need exact match okay now I will drag all this formula here to be sure that all my activities are updated now I'll take the same formula copy here this was column number two this is three this is four so I'll paste it here I will change two into four okay and double click this one then I'll make format cells because this is a date I would like to change it to date I will go to English United States I will choose this date format and that's it you are good to go same here I will do this column number one two three four five so this one I'm going to change to five double click to apply the formula format cells date this format okay 
same here this should be one two three four five six so this is column number six double click okay and that's it I'm going to save now in order to avoid any mistakes after I fill all the data I'm going to copy and paste one two three then I'll save this one and close it now let's import this one so I'm going to my baseline this baseline without any update and I'm going to file import spreadsheet next I'll select my file I'll go to check the baseline the sheet I updated next yeah activities I will import to my project it will recognize my project this is a baseline next finish and that's it the import was successful let's see if it is updating yes definitely now what I need to do I need to run the program to the new data date and that's it very simple very easy I hope you like this video if you have any question write to me in the comments see you in the next lesson